बच्चे देश की धरोहर हैं उनके सर्वांगीण विकास के अवसर इस धरोहर को अमूल्य बना देते हैं उन्हें अवसर दें पलने बढ़ने के चंचल बचपन के पढ़ने लिखने के और आजादी से कुछ करने के विज्ञान में बहुत कुछ करने की संभावनाएं हैं और इन्हीं संभावनाओं को पूरा कर दिखाते हैं बच्चे यानी बाल वैज्ञानिक Since ancient times, the sun has been the only source of energy available to man till coal and petroleum came into the scene. Coal and petroleum, which were discovered about three centuries ago, are not going to last even for a century more. Even other non-solar sources of energy like nuclear energy and geothermal energy are not of the better option because of the adverse effect on the environment. One hope in this direction is the vast water cover of the earth. The world oceans on the whole have the potential to be an inexhaustible source of energy. The energy from them can be harnessed through currents, tides and waves and even the temperature difference that occurs in the sea waters. The waves which are created by the wind action are the basic features of ocean and contain substantial amount of energy. My project is the production of electricity from sea waves. The present model is made with a bucket, a balloon, a copper coil, two springs, two stands and a galvanometer. Just as the waves produced in the sea are used to generate electricity, in the same way the artificial waves created in the water in the bucket are used to generate electricity. There is a balloon which is dipping partially inside the water. The balloon is attached to a spring which is again attached to the bar magnet. This is further attached to a spring and all of them are together suspended through a rigid support. The bar magnet is passing through a copper coil which is suspended from another stand. When we create artificial waves in the water in the bucket, the balloon moves up and down due to which the magnet also moves up and down in the copper coil because of which there is a change in magnetic flux and hence an EMF is induced thereby generating electricity which is shown by the deflection in the galvanometer, which detects very weak currents and also the direction of flow of current. बच्चे क्या कुछ नहीं कर सकते, पर इसके लिए उन्हें छूट देनी होगी, स्वयं कुछ करने की। आप उन्हें प्रोत्साहन दें, ये सब करने का, क्योंकि स्वयं करके और फिर परखकर सीखना ही तो विज्ञान है। तभी उनमें छिपी हुई प्रतिभा का विकास होगा। उनके भीतर का वैज्ञानिक सामने आएगा एक उभरते हुए बाल वैज्ञानिक के रूप में